Okay, you guys, here is the start of Area 3. I don't know if I'm going to get all of it in one video, um, but I'm going to try and get as much of it as I can. Um, just simply so that there's less videos. I don't know how my phone's going to do. I know it's getting on 26%, so... That's why I say I don't think I'm going to be able to get all of it, but I'm going to try my best. So first things first, when you go back this way, well, I'm going to grab this water just in case. So I feel like you need it for something, but I can't remember. You go down here to help turn on the backyard lights um, and get your next key. And then also, when you're out in the backyard, you gotta remember to grab the second missing Mario piece, which is his letter. What's wrong? What's wrong? We should figure it out. Oh, my apologies, I guess it doesn't light up out here. I thought it did, I guess it just lights up the well. That's okay. You also have your outhouse over here. Uh, it's somewhere. You want to get it open and talk to the toad, which I think actually might be what turns on the lights. And he tells you all the five items that are missing, which it's the, the hat, the letter, a shoe, a glove, and a star. So, yeah. Alright, this guy used to be one of my not-so-favorites. I still don't care for him that much because he's kind of a pain in the ass to fight. but And to, like, get around the room and stuff. Ah, shoot hit myself with it. That didn't work out very well. <laughs> That's so funny. Seriously. It would be the fall. Oops. It would be the faux boo though. I'm getting a lot of those this game. I should run and get the key. Oh my god. I'm gonna go find him. Watch him come back in the room in the amount of time it takes me to go back over there. Hmm. 
I hate when they go in a room that you haven't unlocked yet. Because then you're trying to like, you don't know if they're going to stay there. Sometimes they do. But um, then sometimes they do go back. Though something I've learned, if you listen um, while you're playing, is, um, well one, you can do what I just did and check the room again to see if they did go back in there. Um, and then the other thing is, um, you kind of, if you're listening while you play, you'll hear the boo kind of giggle. Um, and when you hear the boo giggle, you can, um, know that that means they went back to the room. I'm not doing very well with my health right now. That's all I'm gonna say. Oh my god. That's okay, I know where there's a heart, but I can go and get one if I have to. See, and that giggle I think meant that he might have went back, so we'll check there in a second. Unless that's the one that's in here. I can get to him. Let go of the freaking thing. Don't. God damn it. Hmm. Alright, well we're gonna go back downstairs and see if that one went back. Even though I don't think it did. No, it didn't. So... We're just going to continue on until we find those two. Oh my god, that's freaking scared me. <laughs> Wasn't expecting it. Are you serious? I'm trying to get the water first, dude. Chill. Oh yeah, he's gonna knock my ass out. I'm gonna come back to him in a second, because I don't got time for this. Oh, gosh. It's only gonna give me ten, but it's better than nothing. And I'm pretty sure there's one behind her, too. starting to do good in the game and now I just, you know, ruined it. Try and go back in here. I know there's water in here.
sweetness. I'm actually gonna go down to the other room real quick to get the one guy. And um, just so I can get the first floor basically taken care of and then I'll come back and do all the stuff that's on the second floor and then I can Gives me a chance to kind of find which jars have hearts in them, because I know some of them do. It's just a matter of which ones. It's not that one. No. I know they do. Am I crazy? I swear. Oh, if nothing else, there's something in here. There should be. Hold on, Ellie. Sorry guys, I had to quickly hit my battery. I think this little one down here might be getting ready for a nap. She seems like she's getting kind of cranky. Also, I remember one of the boos flew into here. The one that was originally in the fitness room, so if it's not in there, then I know he went back to the fitness room. Uh-oh, you dropped your phone. Don't you touch me, mushroom. I'm <laughs> like, don't do it. I guess it came into here because this is still going off and that's even with finding the phobu so I gotta find it now because that's the one that was from the athletic room really and then the other one that was missing went into the grandma's room which we're gonna go to in a second Sorry, y'all. Give me just a moment. I'm going to quickly go lay her down. What's the matter? Is it nap time? Is it nap time? Oh, squishy. Oh, squishy. Sorry, y'all. Give me just a second.
you know, and I just thought of it, y'all. I can be editing the stuff out of the videos when I'm going away for a couple minutes. Because I did just have to change a diaper, too. Just took some extra time. So I'll probably edit all that out of it just sitting here. Come on. Oh, that's right. Duh. <laughs> also, I shake the projector, huh? Correctly, this room gives me his shoe or something or his glove. I can't remember. And I know that we're soon approaching the room that gives him this, gives you his star. finish this room. Don't mind my kid crying if you can hear her. She's a, she's just fighting her nap. She does that sometimes. She kind of will like tease and be like, Mom, I'm tired. But then when you put her in her room, she's like, wait a minute. No, that's not what I wanted. But that's actually what she wanted. Kind of weird like that. So I usually give her about five to ten minutes. And if she's still freaking out like that, then I usually will go in there and bring her out because then I just begin to assume she's not actually tired. She just thought she was. Dude, quit screaming. Well, I got my health a little bit of the ways up. Okay. That crying in there that she's currently doing, she doesn't usually do. So that's gonna lead me to assume she's actually not tired. So, give me... Wait. She's not... Oh, nope, she didn't. Okay. I'm gonna go head my person into this room and I'm gonna quickly go get her out. I'll be right back. About that, you guys. Fuck, come on. Oh, my God. Oh yeah, she gives you access to the twins, I forgot. I actually used to hate doing the twins room. Oh, there's the one that went missing. I used to hate doing the twins room because I would spend hours trying to figure it out. 
And then I recently watched a video that someone else posted, and I don't remember who it was, otherwise I'd give credit, where they showed a little trick to make it so you can find them a lot easier, and I will show you guys that in this clip. And with that, and that trick did work with me too, and it made things so much easier. Okay, let's see. Now we're gonna quickly go grab the stuff that's in this room that gets us his star. Oh crap, that's right, I need flame. One of these things gives you actual flame. I can't remember which one it is. But one of them actually gives you fire. This one. Okay. that 10 health I had just recovered. Alright, this part can sometimes be quick, sometimes not, depends on your aim. I'm not very good. What, tiny? Sorry, I don't know why my kid's being like this today. She's not usually this whiny and crabby. I missed. I don't know, I will say I don't know why it's making me wait. I definitely miss. You want to hit the moon. Did I get it that time? Ah, oh, so close. You have to try and hit, you have to hit the moon with whatever the hell these things are supposed to be. I'm going to assume probably asteroids of some kind. And it leads you to the star.
No, the last thing we gotta find of his is his shoe, which I know is gonna be in one of the other rooms. Now to remember where I'm supposed to go next. Oh, that's right, the twins. I forgot. Just triple checking that I didn't miss any rooms. Nope. So we will go get our twins. And I'll show you all that trick that I was talking about. We're coming up on 26 minutes with this video. So might have to cut it here soon. I'd try to keep them around 30 to 35 minutes. Just hard to say because I don't remember how many boos I use to do part the third one. Sweetness, what? Of course, I also may have to cut it short because my kid's being super clingy right now and I haven't quite figured out what it is that she wants since she's been fed and changed and all that. I think she's honestly just fighting that nap and I just need to help her. Hold on, Tiny, please. All right, okay, hold on. She wants a snack, I think, or something, because she keeps reaching for the high chair. Wait, hold on, your, your thing that I'll screw up. Alright, so here's the little tip. He, they tell you to go outside, which, you know, obviously you do. Then they say you can come in, and then you go in there. Now, the tip that they showed me was this. You go up to it with the vacuum. You vacuum each box. If it moves, they're in there. If it doesn't move, they're not. So like I showed you with that one, it did that first one didn't move, this one did. So I hit it, and there's one of the kiddos. And now you do the same thing with... All the other boxes, nothing in there, and it's shaking, which means it's in there. That has now worked twice with me with trying that tip. I don't know if that was always supposed to be an obvious tip or something, and I was stupid and never figured it out, but I will tell you that that made my life so much easier because when I used to play it years ago, I could never get past this part quickly because I was always trying to just guess with them. Oh no, I don't want to go through. I want to get one. Let's get this one on the ground first. Okay. Oh yeah, see, and there's the shoe. I am like right by the boo here. I'm just trying to get the pearls. Watch it be the faux pearl, or the faux boo. Nope, I guess it wasn't. Oh yeah, see, so um, apologies. I am going to have to cut this video here after the boo, after the twins, after I finish this boo here, because my phone did just tell me that it's about seconds from dying. I apologize. So we're just gonna quickly do this. I mean, it is going to save, so we'll call it good on that. And thank you all for watching. There will be a part two for the rest of Area 3. Thank you.